This afternoon, we will be preparing our station for a mandibular anterior occlusal radiograph. First, we need to prepare our operator station by placing the blue sanitary napkin upon the cubicle. Upon this blue napkin, we can also lay our size 4 phosphor plate, which we will be needing for the occlusal radiograph. Next, we need to place the barrier film over the exposure switch. Once our operator station is set up, we need to set up the patient's room by placing the bag over the patient's chair. Once the patient chair is bagged, we can go ahead and place our patient. When our patient is seated, we need to make sure that their head is fully supported and that the patient chair is at optimum operator's height. We also need to place the thyroid collar around the patient's neck. Next, we need to turn on our machine, and we need to double check that it is on the correct setting for the mandibular anterior occlusal radiograph. For this radiograph, we will need to place it on the anterior setting. Once our machine is ready and set, we will need to place the size 4 phosphor plate um, that will be placed anterior, posterior, or horizontally along the occlusal plane of the patient. For a child, we would use a size 2 film that would be placed on the long axis laterally. When placing the size 4 phosphor plate, we need to make sure that a minimum of 1 centimeter of the film is anterior to the mandibular central incisors. Once the patient has held the film, we can go ahead and aim our array. The pin needs to be placed at a vertical angle of negative 55 to negative 60 degrees with a horizontal angle of zero and centered over the chin. Once everything is placed, we are ready for exposure. We leave the exposure room. And we hit the exposure strict for full exposure. Once we are done, we can relieve the patient of the size 4 phosphor plate and we can go ahead and tear down our cubicle.